Ah! All right, so um, the title's right, bruv. Crash the Fiesta, bruv. Um, <laughs> all right, cool. It was not my fault. I just want to say it right off the bat. It's not my fault. So long story short, what happened was we was at a stoplight and there was a van in front of me and obviously my little tiny Fiesta was behind the van. Oh, that scared the hell out of me. I thought someone was trying to break into my car. Yeah, so um, some kid ran out into the road in front of the van. The van slammed his brakes. The mom, the mother of the kid, nowhere to be found. The van then reversed back to, you know, give himself some distance from the kid so the kid's not scared, you know, because big old fucking Ford grill in the kid's face is a bit scary. So the dude reversed. He didn't see my car there. And bang! Dude crashed my car, bro. The frame of the car itself is absolutely okay. Um, no damages to the frame from this accident. So that's all great. So what I did was I went to Telford and I picked up a front rag pack for 150. Then I went down to my boys at DWA. DWA, DWA, DWA. And they fitted it for me for a very good price. I'm gonna be honest, I was gonna do it myself, but obviously I didn't realize that you, there was so much involved with just changing the front rad pack right it was crazy the only thing that's ruined was the crash bar you can see where the crash bar was stressed up against so you have one part here on the left side one part on the right side the paint is cracked and you can see that it's pushed up a bit more anyway so that happened change the front radiator pack and um yeah bro that's uh that happened um obviously uh, i shall hold my insurance company the guy never reported it, so I'm not fussed anyway because, you know, I I always repair all my stuff myself. And if you get done with the insurance, you're going to wait a long, long time just to get it sorted. And, um, uh, so, uh, if you look at it, rude boy, explain to me how the hell my two pound splitter survived this crash. Not a scratch on the splitter, my guy. It's not even bent out of shape, my guy. And it survived the crash, my G. Are you kidding me, bro? Get this splitter now, because now. Where is it? There's like a little dent there that's dipped down. But it's not really no noticeable from far away. It looks all right. But I also got this crack here. I'm not sure if you can, I'm not sure if you can fix it. So you need to get like a whole new front bumper. But that's the only place. That's a bit cracked. So... Yeah, that's the only really damage of it. Yeah. That's it. That's really the only damage for the um, car. Um, before, the bonnet would not close at all. It, it just wouldn't close. So um, that was down to the crash bar because the crash bar is aligned with the front red pack. So if the crash bar is damaged or bent out of shape, it is not going to close. So yeah, um, that's what happened. Um, just thought I should give you guys a little update. Um, yeah crash my fiesta bro that's crazy that is crazy